Hello YouTube, this is Bomb Seven Eight Nine here. Um it's one of the quick run through something I have finally been working on. Um or actually finally got to work. I've been working on it for quite a while and I'm very proud of it. Um let's just go ahead and show you what I've done. Of course you saw my pre if you saw my previous video and then you show I had a very crappy room, crappy graphics. I just wanted to show you the graphics that I've updated. Also made some new functions. I'm very happy with that. Um, very happy with the functions I made. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show you what I came up with and what has worked. Um, first, run through the code. Uh, there's a couple new functions, as you can see. Function key. You remember that from last uh, last one. And you got the function adventure log and inventory. Those are two new. I'm gonna go ahead and show you uh, what they do. Um, this one, when called will draw an image that I created so it can have a nice looking adventure log. It's gonna draw it's gonna draw text of whatever is put into the variable adventure log that is of type screen. So you can see that right here. Ooh. Um I'm gonna go show you where that happens. So alright. Since we got oh, our key function, which is key pass into variables. Images collide, player key, then yeah, blah, 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 blah. Send it to somewhere that does not exist, or we will never enter 1 million or 1 billion, whatever that number is. Key string equals key, which is for the inventory, and then add log, as we saw earlier. Adventure log string, we picked up the key, and create inventory for the file to write to. Uh, actually, that should be up in the key function, but it's just there for now because I was running through it. Um, does all that stuff. And then we got our calling adventure log and inventory. So just to show you what the new stuff is, I'm gonna go ahead and run through it. As you can see I have a very much better looking map. I'm gonna go all the way around so you can see it. Very, very better map. You see how that works. It's my character. He walks around just like before. Yeah, I gave him a sword because my buddy, graphics dude, actually came. So he, you know, of course you can tell by the new tiles and everything that are been placed. He drew a, a, a flame sword and he told me to put it on the character just for the hell of it, so I did. And it's a very crappy sword. See, it's hovering right there. That's because, you know. So, I got I can walk around. Basically stairs, because I put collision tiles up here. So it's basically, you know, stair thing. And, you know, can't go in the grass yet. I, I just wanted to make, you know, a little cool, little cool map. Alright, so I'm going to go show you something else. My adventure log. <laughs> the adventure log. Um, so I'm gonna go show you what happens with this. Uh, I go, pick up the key, and then as soon as I picked up the key, it pops up. You have picked a big key. I was ecstatic about that. I was so happy. Um, I finally got that to work. So I got our adventure log going on. Um, this probably won't be the final product for the adventure log, but it's just there to you know keep track of basic functionality not for looks yet um, then I got my inventory which we talked about I'm gonna go ahead and show you how that works so since I picked up the key see the key is no longer there so therefore it went into a variable called um, inventory or actually went to the text file that has inventory and so I got the code where it reads text to where it reads uh, what is in the text file it reads the line and then it displays whatever's in that when I press the I key for inventory. And you see the key comes up because it shows that I have a key in my inventory. Yeah, it's not where it's supposed to be. It doesn't have very many graphics, but it just shows the basic functionality that it works. I'll put looks up later when uh, the graphics guy uh, fixes and makes them and all that stuff. So other than that, uh, that's pretty much it. Of course, my little dude, he's walking around. It's all from before, you know. 
flame sword. I should, um, excuse me. Next video, I will probably show you, or probably start working on, um, battle systems. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready for that yet. Uh, battle systems definitely making the adventure log better looking. The inventory, I will be making an inventory screen that actually displays what armor you're wearing, what, uh, what what army you're wearing, your weapons, and all the you know RPG bullcrap and stuff like that. Um, if I have if I probably failed to mention this, I don't remember if I did. This game is an RPG. It is an action adventure. If you ever played any of the old Zeldas, Legend of Zeldas, this is what it's going to be like. Um, hopefully. So we'll see you all at Hobbs in the finished product. Uh, graphics guy came over. We uh, got into some storyline, which I will not release until, uh, you know, the game gets going and I actually have, I can actually show, you know, that they're working and they're in. Other than that, thanks for watching and subscribe if you want to get the instant stuff or the instant update when I post a new video. Thanks and good night.